All right, so here we go. We're here for the first round with the black green reanimation deck, and we will yeah we'll go first. Um, well, I mean I'm not super happy about this one, but I guess that it is. Hmm, is it keepable or not? Well, I mean Lily's good, but uh, yeah, I mean I guess we'll try it. I guess we can try it. And hopefully we'll be able to do do something here with it. Um, yeah, I mean we can turn three Lily, uh, discard one of our unnecessary cards, um, unnecessary and excessive lands. All right, well I like that. I'm not having a turn one play. Uh, let's go ahead and we'll just. Uh, Shaman and pass the turn. Turn three will Lily and then plus it. And if they take off their turn to kill our Shaman, it could be worse. So, okay, Elves of Deep Shadow. Oh, don't mind that too much. And let's see, yeah. Um, well, we'll go ahead and play that. And then, uh, yeah, we'll... Um, Yeah, well, Lily. And I'll discard it. Oh, crap. No, 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 no. Undo. Undo. Discard the Terastodon. Okay. And he just discard the discarded Progenitus, which just went back into his library. So, looks like he may be doing something similar to us here. Good to know. It'd be kind of funny if he also slammed a lily on her. Alright, so searching out. So, he's playing four colors. Yep. Yep. Seems good. Seems good. Do I want to draw two, discard three, or would I rather just bring back my Terastodon? Um. Whenever you or a permanent. Yep. All right. Um, hmm. Well, I guess I could blow all of their lands up with Terastodon. That may not be any good. That may be just how I lose. Um, so maybe I'll have us both discard one first. And then I'll... Well, I don't know if I want to... Do we really want a nasty Terasti here? Because I think we actually may just... Alright, well let's... Let's go ahead and... Plus the Lily. And I think that we're actually going to get rid of our Bazaar here. Lily's on five right now, so that's not necessarily an issue. Um, either that or the confluence, but all right, yeah. So we'll get rid of our uh, we'll get rid of our bazaar. and they'll ditch their mystic snake, and then we will. Makeshift mannequin back. Our Terastodon. And do I want to have them draw three cards and get three three threes with Lily that way? Um, well, you know, I could just make three three threes for myself. 
and then we could just swing for a ton of damage next turn and have them sack a creature. I think I've heard of worse things than that, but um, let's see, he has three lands, four mana, so up to five mana. Um, yeah, I actually think that may be, that may be the move here. You know, it's a little extremely aggressive. And, uh, yeah, we'll just, uh, we'll just pass the turn now. Hoping that he, uh, he doesn't do anything too crazy this turn to disrupt our plans. Sure. And this is probably just something insane. Destroy target non-creature permanent. The lily. Yeah, sure. Sounds good. Yep. All right. Well, it's haste and trample. And it's got persist. Yep, that's right. And sacrifice. Yeah, so, I mean, we'll go ahead and... Um, We'll block it, because I think we kind of need to. It will come back and persist. Um, boom it off our last land. And we can actually, um, let's see, what do we want to do here? Well, we can't actually play our Tasker, because we have that. So if we swing with everything, he blocks there and there, he would take 9, 12, 14. I don't think he wants to do that. He has to block both of them, actually. Because if he doesn't block... Alright. Well, you know what I'd like to do? I'd like to just go ahead and... Swing with everything, probably? Sure. Swing with everything. Sure. So he'll go to one. I'll play the confluence. Pay it black. Play Tassiger. Two, three, four, five. And pass the turn. And we got it. So, yeah, you know, a unique situation. You don't always come into blowing up all of your own lands with only to have your last land destroyed um, as well. But, uh, yeah, that, that worked out okay. Um, so he's also trying to do some kind of broken stuff. Um, as far as things that would be really useful here, um, we only saw... We did see a couple things that Abrupt Decay would hit, but those aren't exactly, hmm, I think we're going to ditch Traverse and bring in Abrupt Decay. I think that's the move here. So, interesting, interesting matchup, that game one, uh, very fast game one. So let's. What are we? What are we looking at here? Um, no reanimation spell. No way to get anything in the graveyard. Uh, we do have a lily. Um, well, we can get things in the graveyard with a lily, but no way to reanimate them back. We do have our lands. All right. I think this is worth a try. It may not be the right decision could be wrong. I mean, we could totally get burned if he has a super quick hand and just, you know, threw the breaches out something awesome. Again, you know, or 
progenitus or that kind of thing. Uh, but, yeah, not the. We get, you know, possibly like a regular reanimate or a tutor or anything like that. Fast bond, okay. Yep. And drop another land. There you go. Yep. And drop another land. Yep. And any plays with it? Yeah, okay. All the mana. All the fast mana. Um, yeah, so he's going to be able to do a whole lot. And another, another land. Oh my gosh. Alright. That is... Wow. That is so much land. Uh, you know, the nice thing is, at least in not this turn, but the next turn, we'll be able to make him sacrifice a creature. Um, unless he just, like, kills us right off the bat here. Uh, which is possible, I guess. And maybe he's going to, like, he can't time spiral or anything. But probably can. Okay. Uh, yeah, so he'll put it on the top of the library and search for a creature card. That's pretty good. <clears throat> Cause a luck. And he has one, two, three, four, five. Just five mana. So. I'll just replay that. And, yeah, we're going to be looking to make him sack his Kozilek when he gets it out. Oh, wow, okay, so he's got channel. Um, I think I'm just going to die now, probably. Yep, yeah, channeling out the Kozilek, and trying to think what we could possibly do here to win this game. <clears throat> Off of a against a turn three Kozilek. Maybe. Yeah, if we had a Dark Ritual or something like that, or if we had a Mox, but unfortunately we didn't draft either of those, so that doesn't do anything for us. And he doesn't high road Shellbock. So trying to yeah, um, trying to what we could possibly do here. <clears throat> um, yeah, yeah, we'll just we'll just scoop. Um, it's got annihilator of four, so we're just gonna lose our our board position there. All right, well, that was uh, not definitely not where we wanted to be. I don't even think there's anything we can... I mean, I think that's just a pretty much impossible place to come back from there. So we'll just we'll just run it back again. I mean... Not sure what difference it, it would have made. Having our... Yeah, if we hadn't had our land put back on top, then we would have been able to Lily and get him to sacrifice the Kozilek. He still had, I think, four cards in hand after drawing a card to the castle. So that's, that would have been a bummer, but would have had better odds than we had here. Well, we have, um, so I guess the issue here is that we chose to be on the play instead of on the draw. And that was probably not the best decision. So we'll keep this hand though. Um, so here, I think we start off with just the Quagmire. We have to find some way to get some creatures in our graveyard, but if we can, it's quite nice. So, um, hopefully he doesn't have as ridiculous of a start. Oh gosh. Well, there goes Fastball here. Maybe he won't have as many lands he's putting on this time. 
Well, only fast spawning for one is not as bad. Um, and we'll go ahead and hit him. And we got Harmonize and Time Walk. Wow, talk about a great hand. That is, that is really something there. Okay. And fast bond hitting. Okay. Yep, and there we go there. So, all right, well, I guess we're going to end up entombing and reanimating. <laughs> So yeah, let's go ahead and we'll entomb. What do we want here? I think this is going to determine probably pretty much the game. Um, so possibilities. We could do Terastodon again. And I think that actually may be what we what we end up doing is just going Terastodon and then the big the big finish again. We could do Woodland Primus, but I don't I don't like that as much. Um, yeah, we'll do we'll do Terastodon. And then let's go ahead and just reanimate it. Put the ability on the stack. Blow up all our lands again. Yep. Put them in any order. Pass the turn. Hope he doesn't have a way to bounce our Terastodon or take care of it. And we got there. All right. Uh, GG's. So, uh, got round one, and uh, it's nice.